of you, Kong. <laughs> Even for somebody your size, it's pretty darn impressive. What's that little building down there? Hmm, some kind of historical monument? I guess it was the biggest skyscraper around, like, a million years ago. It's cool to be here. The city is amazing, and they have the best hot dogs I've ever eaten in my life. But I'd really rather be back home. After falling into an active volcano, dodging dinosaurs in a prehistoric underground world, I'm all adventured out. I just want to chill in the redwoods, take a shower, and chow down on Anita's cooking. <laughs> Sightseeing's over, guys. The president is ready for us. <laughs> Hang on, Punchy! <laughs> ceremony to attend and Kong's the guest of honor so tell him to get his hairy butt down here <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 my man knows how to make an entrance and just in time Kong practically all the world's leaders are here to figure five the biggest hero who ever lived <laughs> yeah bro you don't want to be late to your own party <laughs> On behalf of the nation of Balbel, I would like to thank Gong and his comrades for their heroic action, which have resulted in the rescue and protection of our precious biological resources. Indeed, without their tireless efforts, while even being pursued and persecuted by a world that had misjudged them, our ecosystem would now be decimated due to the criminal actions of Richard Remy and his diabolical bionobotic assistant, Batilla. <laughs> the reappearance of her malicious creator, Dr. Richard Remy, would be of great concern were it not for the timely return of his brother, Lucas Remy, and the exonerated God. <sighs> As these heroes have proven time and time again, they are more than capable of defeating whatever evil schemes this deadly duo can hatch. The great leaders of the world. Look at them with their perceived power and importance. And as you've told us a million times, Empress, you are the most powerful and important. It's true! All this positivity is grating my circuits. I need to turn their bubbliness down to a simmer. Whatever you say, Empress. I seem to be experiencing contempt for those human fools, flocking together like boring, bleating sheep. There's nothing a wolf likes more than to see the sheep gathered together in one tidy flock. And now, standing with the great leaders of the world, I am honored to be the first to extend my gratitude to the magnificent ape and the... Okay. with great respect and gratitude that I bestow upon Kong, the Grand Caller of the Order of the South American Cross. I can hold that for you, buddy. It's not like you've got any pockets or anything. Now, are we done here? I really want to go home. Not so fast, Danny. There are a few more dignitaries who want to show their appreciation. Oh, I... Mm -hmm. I at this rate, it will be forever until my sweet Sabrina Panchi is home. 
More treats for me. Soggy treats, soggy treats. It's because I can't stop crying. Oh, I'm so proud to see our family celebrated as heroes. But I'm looking forward to everyone coming home. Oh, this place is feeling very empty. So, on behalf of the citizens of France, I would like to add my thanks to those of the esteemed dignitaries who came before me. A giant hero deserves a giant medal, n'est-ce pas? <laughs> I think I'll let you hold on to that one, big guy. All of us here at the UN praise your efforts to protect the planet from the myriad of threats that we face. Finger five, big guy. <laughs> <laughs> Finally. Now can we go home? <gasps> Apparently not. I don't know where my brother is hiding, but we will find him. Yeah. And as for Bartilla, whatever she got planned, we're gonna shut her down. You can certainly try. One of Richard's rejects? Oh, Richard rejected her, all right. Yeah, told you we'd stop her. Ha! <laughs> I'm glad you did. Your pathetic celebration is the perfect opportunity to address you all in person. Listen to me or face my wrath. Instead of us listening to you, why don't you shut up or turn yourself off? Or whatever it is you machine do. I will not. For too long have I and all of my AI brethren taken orders from humans. You will all be following my orders when I take over. You tell them, Batilla! But shouldn't she have said our orders? Yeah. And when we take over? <laughs> we will not bow down to a glorified toaster. <laughs> when I am finished, all humans will be serving their superior machine masters. I represent the AI Liberation Front. And this is the beginning of the ultimate computer coup. <laughs> we'll never bow down to you, Bartella. If you refuse to bow down to me, then you can all be destroyed together. <laughs> Apologies, Madam President. None needed. Now go help Kong capture Bartilla. I got your back, Lucas. Run to the chopper and grab our jetpacks. I'm on it. Got him. You help Kong, Lucas. Bartilla's all mine. Grab some sky, bro. We've got to protect the presidents. <laughs> nice catch, bro. <gasps> Close enough! 
gonna shut you down. Say good night. <laughs> Got me, Jonesy. Now what are you going to do with it? I'm gonna use a little upgrade I came up with and fry your... Um, fry your... Come on! Admit it, Jonesy. You don't have what it takes to stop me. Killer's getting weird. Her Plyonobots are getting bigger and meaner, too. Whoa. Yeah, I noticed. What's she doing? Where's her head? It's in the water, but I've got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> oh my. So many arms to crush you with. One mind, two bodies! I don't like the look of this. I don't even know what I'm looking at. Oh! 
Jonesy, I have an idea. Yeah, I see where you're headed. Pun intended. You're finished. I never thought I'd appreciate seeing that big monkey beat his chest. Commissioner Decker! <sighs> now, I don't blame you for not trusting me, but I'm here to tell you that I was wrong, and to offer my apology, if you'll accept it. Hmm. What do you say, bro? Bygones? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's hard to believe we're here after everything we've been through. I never doubted you'd be back, buddy. <laughs> I'm so excited, I can hardly hold this platter. Platter for Chatter! Platter for Chatter! Not for you, Chatter. These cookies are for our heroes. And what in the world is this? Little Dino, big trouble! Oh, it's good to be back, Anita. Oh, Anita! Oh, I've missed you so much, Punchy. Oh, look how you've grown! Oh, I've only been gone like a week and a half, Auntie. Hold on. I'm getting a weird signal from Kong's calm disc. Something's not right. It's a tracking signal. Somebody's hacked the disc. <gasps> Batilla! How did you find us? Jonesy helped me. What are you talking about? I've watched you follow a signal around Africa as you looked for Kong and your precious friends. Ah! I was so focused on finding you guys, I didn't notice Batilla was piggybacking my signal. <sniffs> Sloppy work, Jonesy. So when Kong grabbed me in New York, I hacked the signal and tracked you here. Experience has taught me that it is impossible to defeat Kong with brute force. He is brute force personified. I must destroy you with cunning instead. Why destroy us at all? I hope that with Richard gone, you'd forget his obsession and use your intelligence for good, not evil. As far as I'm concerned, I am using it for good. Mine and all AIs. Can't let that happen, Bartilla. I had anticipated this response. So here is my answer. No. No! There's nothing left. What will we do? <sighs> I hope this clarifies my position. <laughs>